realistic olive branch watercolor painting tutorial front and back sides of these beautiful and fine leaves hello from sunny provence of france i'm here spending summer and found a beautiful olive tree decided to paint a tutorial for you an outline drawing is done which is available for download now remove the excess amount of graphite off the paper and it is so helpful to have a real life subject in front of you using my color swatches i can pick the right color recipe i need i'm comparing with the real live leaves it is very helpful especially for a beginner artist to have these swatches and find the right recipe which suits best now let's choose watercolors apply water to color palette starting with ultramarine blue transparent yellow and alizarin crimson and now i'm adjusting adju adjusting these three pigments ultramarine blue transparent yellow and alizarin crimson to get the backside color of these leaves the backside color is much much lighter cooler and paler green so that's what i have using these three pigments second mix is for front side of the leaves sap green adding perlin green more perlin green adding lemon yellow and i have more warmer saturated darker green color adding more perlin green to adjust the darkness and lemon yellow for some veins and edges now let's start painting. I have my drawing in front of you and starting with the back side of the leaves. Using round synthetic brush, applying water, be sure that your water is clean after mixing watercolors. So you have clean first watery layer, not using too much water, just enough for watercolors to be moved where I need them. And for the back side of these leaves, I'm painting really, really transparently. I'm looking on my reference and I can see that those back side of the leaves are very light. And that's what I need. I need to contrast between front side and the back side, which is completely two different colors. It will help me achieve realistic look in this beautiful composition. And the first layer, is very transparent as you can see on my color palette the amount of watercolors is very small
studying my painting, comparing to reference, noticing maybe I need some more contrast in the shadow area and adding final touches. This was a very nice and quite fast practice. Also learned a lot of new things like greater precision, smooth transitions, reserving light space. Wonderful opportunity to have a real olive branch in front of me. As I come from northern part of Europe, for me this is a really rare occasion to have a live olive branch and by placing it beside my painting I can compare some sections, some leaves, color tones and give a final touches to my painting. Thank you for being here, thank you for trying this tutorial. Hope you learned something new and see you in my next tutorials. Bye bye! Thank you.